on our raft was a great idea, Edward. It would have been quite a job carrying it to the stream. Like my dad always says, before you use muscle power, don't forget to use brain power. I know. It'd be even easier if we used sail power. Hmm, it might work. The mast is secure, the sail's tied down good and tight. We'll have to figure out how we're going to steer. Hang on, Edward. Who needs a river? We built a land raft. I'd better gather in a bit of sail. We don't want to get going too fast. We're fine, Edward. Good old Edward. He worries too. <gasps> Look out! Who? Who's there? Someone knocking? Who? <laughs> I just remembered another thing my dad always says. What's that? Before you go for a drive, don't forget to test the brakes. Hey, what happened to the stream? I've never seen it this low. Well, at least we know our raft floats. But we won't be able to sail it anywhere. Well, if that's the worst of your troubles, then you're the lucky ones. My poor little tadpoles are trapped in this tiny mud puddle, and the river's getting lower by the minute. Oh, no! Hang on, Mrs. Frog. We'll be right back. Well, it's not like we're going anywhere. Not till my babies sprout their legs anyway. Thanks, Dad. Anytime, son. Hmm. What's happened to the water pressure? Dear? Could you come in and check the kitchen taps? There's no water. Hmm, looks like the fountain's blocked up again. Remind me to tell Dad. He'll have to come and fix it. What's that? Somebody's banging on water pipes. I'd know that sound anywhere. Ouch! Oops! I'd know that sound anywhere, too. Let's see what's going on. Oh, good. Helpers. Could you give me a hand here? You bet. A metal flower. It looks like a sprinkler head. Right you are. I'm installing them all over Nutwood. Uh-oh. You forgot the washer. Washer? Never mind. I found one in my pocket. That's Edward. He knows all about water pipes and things. My dad's a plumber. I help him out all the time. I'm Rupert. Pleased to meet you, boys. I'm Tyro. You've probably heard of me. Uh, well... You must have heard of the Tyro Dewdrop Atomizer. Williams of Spring used to have to apply dew one drop at a time. My invention revolutionized the dew and morning mists department and got me promoted to head of Nutwood Plants and Flowers Watering Division. Well done. Congratulations, Tyro. Yeah, but it's nothing compared to the Tyro Water All Sprinkler System. No more dragging around heavy barrels of rainwater and watering one plant at a time. From now on, just turn a handle and presto, everything gets watered. Sounds like a very clever idea. Clever? It's sheer genius. Too bad it won't work. Ah, you don't know it won't work. I haven't even turned it on yet. Well, you haven't been using the proper washers. And these pipes are just taped together. When they should... I never worry about the small details, Edward. The first thing is to get my system up and running. I'll work the hitches out later. I don't know. My dad always says it's better to be safe than sorry. Ha! Ah, no great discoveries would ever get made if everyone had that attitude. There may be another problem, Tyro. Problems, problems. Is that all you two ever think about? Sheesh! It's just that you might not have anywhere to get water. Nutwood Stream has run dry. 
No problem. That's my doing. It is? Of course. I had to shut off the main valve for all of Nutwood while I'm installing my new system. I've never heard of shutting down a whole river before. How long will it be shut off? Mrs. Frog is very concerned about... Tell her not to get her flippers in a knot. The water will be back on in no time. Let's go tell Mrs. Frog the good news. See you later, Tyro. Not likely, Rupert. The king will probably promote me all the way up to Imp Headquarters. Soon everyone will know the name... Tyro? Well, whoever he is, I hope he gets the river back to normal soon. He said it'd be back on in no time. I wonder what's taking him. <gasps> ah! Yeah! Ah! A swamp creature! You're not a swamp creature. <laughs> Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Chief Inspector of Waterworks, Nutwood District. Sorry I startled you. I opened that hatch to divert some water from the stream for use in Nutwood Fountain. But it looks like things are just as bad up here. I don't understand what the problem could be. Oh, we know what the problem is. It's Tyro. Who's Tyro? He's the spring imp in charge of watering all the plants and flowers in Nutwood. He shut off the Nutwood water main. He what? A spring imp has no business messing with the waterworks without my authorization. Oh, I'll have to deal with him later. Right now, I'd better get Nutwood's water turned back on. Would you boys like to come along? Of course! You bet! It won't be long now, Mrs. Frog. Amazing! Welcome to the Waterworks. It's not often I run into anyone on my job. Usually I'm down here keeping things flowing. Just making sure everyone's wells are filled is a full-time job in itself. Granny Goat. Hello! Hello! But minding the wells is only one of my duties. I have to tend all the Nutwood waterways. Tiddler's Pool, Nutwood Fountain, Farmer Brown's Pond. And this is the main supply pump for Nutwood Stream. Wow! Wait till I tell Dad about this. We get our water from Lake Nutchester, then distribute it to Nutwood and the surrounding area using a system of canals and sluice gates to divert and control the flow. Er, uh, when there is a flow, that is. Gosh, I've never really given much thought to where the water in our taps comes from. Hmm, most people don't, until it stops working. Then, it's all they can think about. Right now, we're directly underneath Lake Nutchester. No kidding! Brilliant! The main valve is just up this way. This is definitely part of Tyro's system. <laughs> Judging by his work, I'd say he's got a lot to learn. No kidding! Wow! Tyro! Hey, fellas! Just in time for the grand opening. Don't touch that wheel! What? Says who? The Chief Inspector of Waterworks, that's who. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm Tyro. I happen to be a personal favorite of the Imp King himself. At least I will be once the King gets a load of the Tyro Water All Sprinkler System. Oh, this is all I need. Uh-oh. You should have put a main shut-off valve here, Tyro. Why would I want a shut-off valve? I want to turn it on. 
Now I'll have to disconnect this ridiculous conglomeration before I can turn Nutwood's water back on. What? You can't do that. What about all my hard work? What about my promotion? What about obtaining a proper permit? Oh, yeah? Well, you just wait till the Imp King hears about this, and don't think I'm not going to tell him. Oh, I'm afraid this is more than a one-man job. I'll need to requisition a full work crew. No telling how long it will take. We'd be willing to help if it will get the water back on faster. I have my own toolbox. Well, now, that would be most helpful, boys. Let's go and get your toolbox, Edward. You'll be doing the entire community a service. Huh, there's a whole lake up there. All I'm using is a drop in the bucket. Huh, once the inspector sees how well my system works, he'll be the first to congratulate me. No problem. doesn't seem to be mechanical. Hmm. <laughs> well, dear, looks like we're back in business. That impertinent imp! I ordered him not to touch anything. Wow, neat! I've never seen it do that before. Well, we can't go back that way. Come along, boys, no time to lose. There's no water for tea, and the next it's pouring out of every nook and cranny. What's happening? Not what? Who? Who? Tyro! See? No problem. Works like a charm. Just like I... My tree is a fountain! My burrow is a fish tank! Well, there may be a few little wrinkles to smooth out. More than a few! Ah! My house! Tyro, exactly how far did you open the main valve? All the way, of course. It's the only way to do things. It should never be open more than one quarter of the way. <gasps> oh, oh, oh. This thing seems to have a life of its own. Oh, ah. We could sure use our raft right about now. There's a repair station just ahead. It has all the equipment we'll need. Quickly, put these on. It's a little late for boots. Our feet are already soaked. These boots will do a lot more than keep your feet dry. They're called water skates. Hey, neat! I thought we might have to do a bit of swimming, not skating. <laughs> Skates take a little getting used to. Ha! Nothing to it, see? No problem. Tyro, this is no time for fun and games. If that valve isn't shut off immediately, all of Lake Nutchester will empty into Nutwood. Oh, thank you. 
be careful, dear. Don't worry. I'll tame that wriggling viper. On guard! My word! Now it's talking! Yay! Who was that? idea, Edward. If there's one thing I know how to do, it's plug up a drain. <laughs> Wait till I tell Dad about this. I want that sprinkler system of yours dismantled immediately. Sure. <laughs> no problem. Hello, boys. Mrs. Frog. How are your tadpoles doing? I'm happy to say that all 87 of them are doing just swimmingly. Only they're not tadpoles anymore. Hello, Ruben. Hi, Edward. Good morning. Look at us. We got Flippert. Wanna come swimming? Excellent. Everything is exactly the way it was a few days ago. Not exactly, Inspector. <laughs> oh, yes. So I see. They grow their legs so quickly. Try and be an innovator and what happened? I get demoted all the way down to junior assistant imp in the rock rotation department. How's your new job going, Tyro? Hm. I have to walk around all day turning over rocks so both sides have a chance to weather evenly. Sounds like hard work. Not anymore. Thanks to my Tyro Auto Rock Flopper. This will get me that promotion for sure. Yes, siree. Soon everyone will know the name. Ta Tyro! <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Just a few little wrinkles to smooth out. 